What's up? This is Josh from SeekTheSunrise.com and today we're on top of the second tallest volcano in Guatemala. It's around 13,000 feet. It's called Acatenango. Behind us is the mm -hmm. volcano Fuego, which is an active volcano. So when you're up on top of here, you can watch it explode. It's pretty awesome. The trail up the volcano begins at dawn on a path that will take you up 5,000 feet of elevation and 8 miles round trip. The hike itself heads through four distinct sections. The first is a farmland which you will most likely be enjoying at sunrise, and this area has a lot of uphill with very loose rock. The next is a jungle which has a lot of switchbacks, a few houses for rest, and much needed shade on the way back down. Be sure to take this area in because it's lush and green and you'll want to remember it while you're slogging along towards the top. Next you will head into the cloud forest which has a sparse collection of trees that dot the landscape and amazing views of how far you've come. This is also where you'll cross the halfway point for this hike. This area takes a while because the switchbacks are big and long and the elevation starts to get to you. Be sure to take your time, enjoy the shade, and enjoy the views that are all around you. Lastly, you will reach the volcano itself. The first view of the volcano is daunting and beautiful at the same time. If you are lucky, you may even see the active volcano Fuego fuming from here as well. Proceeding up the volcano's face is the most difficult part of the hike, as it is one step forward and a half step back in loose sand. Be sure to take your time. If you look closely, you can even see pockets of gas escaping from the volcano you are on as you head up its face. When you reach the top, you will see the massive cone with amazing views from all angles and even a lizard or two if you're lucky. Grab your lunch and just sit here and watch Fuego spewing smoke. I guarantee you will be the only time in your life you eat lunch looking down on an active volcano. For more information on this and other hikes, be sure to check out SeekTheSunrise.com.